So remember the overall process, there's the five of us, right? You, us, the syndication, the lender, the investors. So what happens is in order to get started, step number one is pay the setup fee. And that's gonna be between 5,000 to $25,000. And that's upfront. The other upfront fee is one, or let's just say one and a half for the letter of guarantee, okay? We have to make sure that you have the money for the letter of guarantee because we like to move quickly. We wanna make sure that you're qualified. Remember that letter of guarantee is the collateral for your loan. The lender will not make a loan without the collateral. The letter of guarantee is how they are secured their capital. The setup fee comes to us. One and a half percent for the letter of guarantee goes to the investors. We are going to take the application, send it to the committee, they look at it, then they're going to send a term sheet. Once you get the term sheet, if you're good with the terms, then we ask for the one and a half percent to go into a share account with our credit union. We hold that there in a separate account and we give it a thumbs up. Now, when we give the thumbs up, the syndication is going to write up the contracts and send us back all the paperwork, all the contracts, everything that we need in order to get everything going. You review all that paperwork, you sign it. If you have a corporate seal, you seal it, you notarize it, those are the requirements. Everything needs to be notarized and legalized. And once we have all that paperwork back, then we send it back to the syndication. And in that moment, in that same day, we send the 1.5% to the investors. Once the investors have that money, they start writing the letter of guarantee, doing all the legalities and everything that they need to do to issue that. That gets, that's step number two, the issuing of the letter of guarantee. Once that gets issued, that is the point where your 1.5% is no longer refundable. Services have been rendered for the letter of guarantee. And if you try to pull back for whatever reason after this point, then you lose that one and a quarter percent, you lose the setup fees. Of those, that letter of guarantee, half a point comes back to us as an initiation fee for working with the investors. Now, step two, the letter of guarantee gets sent. Now, everything starts working in the lender's offices with their legal team and uh, their underwriting teams. When they start looking at all the paperwork, if they feel that there's a lot of risk, they might come back and ask for, for what they call a certificate of insurance. And that certificate of insurance is typically 10% of the loan amount but we negotiated down to 5%. So step three is the legal department underwrites everything. They look at everything. If they do ask for this 5%, then we have to be ready to, to send them that money for that insurance coverage. We always ask for the 5% and the 1.5% upfront. The 5% might not be needed. The 1.5% goes into our credit union's uh, share account. You can put that 5% in there too, or you can put it anywhere you want. We just want that 5% separate, separate, ready to work, ready to get sent in the event that we do need to pay it. There could be the event where you, they don't require it from you and you get to keep that money and, and then it's yours and we never needed it. But in the case that we do need it, we need to make sure that you're qualified and capable of being able to send that money. So that's why we ask that you keep it set aside in the event that, that it is asked of you. Step number four, uh, the lender and the investors or the lending bank and the investors get together and they start coordinating the bonds and the investments. And these are all uh, AAA bonds, American bonds and Euro bonds and municipal and, and corporate bonds in the New York Stock Exchange. And so that gets coordinated. Uh, after the two or three days with the investors, it takes about another 10 days to coordinate the bonds and the investments. And once that's put in place, then they go ahead and uh, we move forward 
to step number five, which is where commissions are paid and funds are sent to the client. The uh, lending bank pays the syndication their commission, they pay us our commission, and then the client gets their funds. And so all this process takes a minimum of 15 banking days on our end. I can usually tell the clients it can take up to 60 days based on the client speed and getting us the paperwork that we need, getting the money set aside that they need to get set aside and getting everything going. So we're 15 days, three weeks, we can get everything processed and funded fairly quickly. The rest of the process depends on the client and, and how fast we're able to move things with them. So anyway, that's, uh, that's the overview of the plan and, and the program and how we work and what Exit Plan Pro is able to do for you as one of our clients. And we're excited again to be working with you. And if you have any questions, just get back together with the representative that introduced you to this video. Uh, again, this is Ramon Navarro. Thank you for your time and uh, I wish you lots of success.